I'm an addict for sneakers, 20s of Buddha and bitches with beepers in the streets I could reach her about Yo, what up YouTube? It's your boy Nate Triple OG, often imitated, never duplicated, breaking you the best on peeps in the game. Yo, if you're new to the channel, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell so you can stay in tune with all the fire that I got coming to you. Today's review is going to be of the Off-White Street Runner. Yo, I got kind of lucky on getting these. I did a couple raffles in the city and did not hit. I don't know how I didn't hit. I didn't hit on those raffles and then so happens that No Trey ended up doing um, a raffle through um, the Frenzy app and I did that and I ended up getting the shoe. Now, I, 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 I got a bone to pick with that Frenzy app. You know what I mean? I have a bone to pick with the Frenzy app. Like, the shoe retails at 190 right but i end up paying like a few extra taxes a limited item tax a limited item tax cuz that's neither here nor there so let's go ahead let's talk about the shoe and i'm gonna give you guys one of these on feet it's not gonna be the coldest on feet in the game today because it's cold as hell outside today but i am gonna give you an on feet but let's go ahead get up close and personal with these shoes right here Ooh. Yo, this thing right here, man, I believe that this was the colorway to have, so I'm glad I was able to get this one. Now, a lot of people are saying, yeah, you got the shoe only because it was a brick. You know what I'm saying? Insert my man. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, uh, I happen to disagree. Now, the shoe, if you remember on my uh, MCA vlog, I'll put a link right there so you guys can go check that out. They had, like, a different pair. Now, the pair that they made, even though this is the colorway, there are some different things matter of fact i do have this book so if you went to the mca i know they're gonna do it in atlanta if you went to the mca i know they're gonna do it in atlanta you make sure you pick up this book man it has a lot of things that you could see and that you can uh, i guess go back to and for instance we're gonna go back to it because we're reviewing this shoe there are some slight differences as far as like how the shoe was uh i guess the um the prototype model was then the, uh, the model that came out, so there are a couple differences, but let's go ahead and get up close and personal with the shoes right about now. Alright, so first things first, let's go ahead and look at that box. You got Nike on the lid in the upper left hand corner, and let's get into that size. Size 10 and a half, which it, well, size, well, I'm confused, okay. <laughs> Size 10, 10 and a half, which uh, equals a women's, uh, I mean a men's 9. Uh, okay, anyways. Alright, so this box has all these extra holes in it. I don't know what is that for. I don't know if it's there to help the shoes breathe. You have this uh, off-white paper. This is an inside. Forget this. Let's move this goddamn camera around. So you got this off-white paper that's in the inside. It has off-white all over it. Um, let's go ahead and take the shoes out and get into those things, right? So let's take a boom. Here's one, and let's get the other one. Yeah, take that thing out of there. Now, I at first I was kind of confused, like, what is this extra? Hold on, let me get this crap out of the way. So, boom, there we go. So we got both pairs of shoes right here. Um, definitely comes with those classic uh, laces, like always. Ah. Anyway, you got this extra lacing system up top, like so. Uh, blue tongue right there. Uh, black Nike sign. Sit this thing down because we don't have to have that camera moving around anymore. So, yeah. Black laces. And the inside of the shoe, you got that off-white branding. Like so. Got those shoestring. I mean, those shoe laces that say laces. This pair of shoes does not come with any extra laces. Just the one pair there. Definitely comes with this situation right here. Now, this does, like, tighten the shoe up. You can, like, pull it. And you can tighten it. I can show a video on uh, Virgil's page, I guess, of I guess of how you're supposed to tie up the shoes. You got that black Nike sign here. You got these rubber spikes on the bottom. Now, these are just, these are rubber. These are not actual spikes with a pink Nike sign on the bottom, gray. This heel reminds me of the Zoom Fly. So, this is a running shoe. Um, silver, whatever this is, like a plastic overlay on the back. If you move this down... You can see that it says uh, Nike on the back. Sorry, it's so close. You probably can't even tell, right? Got that bling on there. So that's not bad. Like, got that classic sponge tongue. Pretty dope shoe, in my opinion. And the inside, you do have a silver whoop, metallic 
Nike sign. So it seems like the whole shoe is like covered in like a fishnet plastic bag type thing. The shoe actually reminds me of the Ikea bag. <laughs> You know what I mean? I mean that's kind of funny, seeing as though he just did um, the collab with Ikea again, which I was so fortunate enough to get the um, wet grass rug. They say that thing is a brick. It's a brick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, who cares? You know what I mean? Get what you like. Yo, pretty dope shoe, in my opinion. But let's go ahead and put these things on feet so you can see what they look like. Once again, it's cold as hell outside, and I ain't going out there. I'll put these on in the crib for y'all. Let's go. It's a whole new way, big come play with a shark. It's a whole new day, I can't complain so far. I've been doing my thing, so niggas know who we are. If you don't got no drive, bitch, you can wait in the car. That ain't cool, yo man. Know that I've been inside that cat, but that nigga can't even fight like that. How we feel knowing I had your bitch fucked her real, real good and gave her right, right back on my fuck love. I'm a pimp, I'm a flip inside the bitch. Light the tree, cut the stem, and fuck again. Man, that's a I made a bitch. whole new play out of the so far. We got a whole new thing, let's make a whole new start. You be my down ass bitch. You be my down ass bitch. Cause you's a down ass bitch. You's a down ass bitch. I can't. Wake these niggas up or ever give a fuck I can't, I can't. Seem to keep a bitch or ever stay in love I ain't, I ain't. Ever fiending over drinks or a drug I'ma start connecting in this bitch Tell your nigga I'm the motherfucking plug I'ma shine I won't throw shade on the soul I'ma grind And never trick on a whole year Right? I done lost more friends and foes But ain't that how it's supposed to go Whoa, let me do what I'm supposed I ain't Trippin' over no bitches I ain't sliding, falling, slipping All you running is your motherfucking mouth You must not know who in the motherfucking house I made a whole play out of the so far we got a whole So how did you like that on feet, man? How do you like these shoes? Do you really think that it's a brick? You know, me personally, um, the way the shoe fits It does fit like a little narrow, you know what I mean? A little narrow like right here because it is a woman's shoe you know what i mean so it is a women's shoe it fits narrow but they did make them in extend extended sizes um but it's not bad now is this something that i would wear for like casual wear uh probably probably you know i probably would even though we know that the shoe is uh meant for running and all those type of things you know i think it's kind of fly man it's kind of fly um the hype is not there for the shoe uh, at least that is what it is right now. But the hype also wasn't there for the last pair that came out. I can't remember the name, but I'll put a picture like right here. You know what I mean? For, so for that shoe right there, no hype was there for that shoe. And it definitely wasn't any resale value on that shoe. So, um, yeah. I mean, so if you are a woman and you just really wanted the shoe. Now, I know, like I said, it's not... It is a running shoe, but it can be worn regu regularly. Um, we got a picture of LeBron James wearing a pair. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, but, like, hey, I think it's dope. Uh, I'm glad to have it inside the collection. Uh, will I be reselling this one? I definitely wouldn't. Will I be uh, getting rid of it? Uh, definitely not. Um, I like it. I actually like it. That's why I bought it. Um, wouldn't even put it up for no trade bait or anything like that. It's a dope shoe to me. Um... Thank you guys for watching the video. Thanks for leaving that feedback. Make sure you, uh, oh, make sure you guys go to the Travis Scott video. You know what I'm saying? We got to do that giveaway, man. I got these Travis's. They just sitting here looking for a home. But as soon as we get to do that, <laughs> as soon as we get to 2,000 subscribers, we definitely will be shipping those things off to some lucky subscriber who actually wanted a pair of Travis's that couldn't get a pair. Hopefully a real ranger guess this pair of shoes is going to be jumping up and crazy inside the mud like i saw so many pictures of so many people at astro fest man i appreciate you guys for rocking with me how you guys next time peace no time soon